Hello, this is Eli from SafeNet Ask Technical Support. I would like to show you something which relates to a license update. Uh, suppose that I have received from my customer a C2V, but the C2V is a very old one, it does not represent the current status of his uh, license uh, key. Uh, and I'm trying to check it in. So I get uh, an error or maybe a warning that order number 35 needs to be reapplied. Now it's not true because I've already uh, have done it uh, previously because uh, and since this uh, C2V is an old one it does not reflect in the C2V. Uh, it's not an updated uh, C2V but I have no alternatives or other options to know it. So I'm just trying to create a new update and generate a file and then, I, and then I get this message this error message unable to generate ASP update now in such cases uh, the most uh, useful uh, procedure to to follow is uh, is as, as the following uh, first I would uh, suggest to ask the customer to use the RAS utility and create a new C2V of his uh, key. So let's erase the old C2V. We don't know, we don't remember exactly if this is the latest or not. So please create a new C2V. Let's do it. Call it uh, OK2. So uh, this is OK now. It's ready. I can uh, edit with any editor to see whether it's the the, fi the ASP ID that I'm talking about. And now let's try to check it in and see whether it's working. OK, two, check in. Fine. Now I see that order number 35 was acknowledged, which means everything is OK, no problems. So uh, in most of the cases when you have some problem, first uh, send the Rust utility to your customer and ask him to provide you with a new fresh C2V which represents the exact uh, situation, the exact uh, capture uh, of, uh, your, of the customer's license at the same time. Thank you for watching.